Hello everyone, here I'm back with another bunch of fun activities for you. I'm sure you're going to enjoy it. So let's get started. Lazy rack picker. Pick the plastics on the floor either by kicking it up or just by lifting it up using your foot and catch with your hand, both hands. Use your both feet at the time. Once you finish collecting, you have to run towards the garbage bin to dispose it. To make it easier, use sizable plastic bags or reduce the number of plastics. Try to collect as many plastic as you can in the given time and try to do it as fast as you can so that you can collect more garbage in the given time. In the second variation, you have to drag the plastic bag with your foot one at a time to the garbage bin and dispose it with your foot only. Use both feet. To make it easier, you can use your hand to dispose the plastic. And to make it difficult, you have to pick the plastic and jump on one leg to dispose it. Remember, you have to take plastic uh, to the disposal bin only by foot either by putting your foot inside the plastic bag or just keep the plastic on the top of your foot and you have to jump at the same time and dispose it you cannot use a hand to dispose it save the fish put balloons in each plastic bag and scatter it all over the place just imagine that the balloons are the fish trapped inside the plastic in the ocean. You have to rescue all the fish by taking them out of the plastic bags by using your, using your foot only. Try to rescue as many as you can and as fast as you can. To make it easier, either reduce the number of trapped fishes or you can use a hand to rescue all the fishes in the given time. Here you can challenge yourself by rescuing as many fishes as you can in a given time and next time you can try to beat the same timing by rescuing uh, even more fish uh, in less time than the previous one. You can even play with your friends to beat each other timing. This is a very fun way to develop your motor skills. Movers. Toss the balloon up and simultaneously move the plastic and the balloon to the other side once at a time and catch the tossed balloon before it drops down on the floor. Try to do it as many times as you can. Along with bilateral coordination, this activity helps you to improve your reaction ability. To make it easier, you can reduce the distance between each sofa or whatever you are using or you can reduce the number of objects being used. Well. These are a few activities, fun activities for you. See you next time with more fun games like this. Till then, take care, stay safe. Bye-bye.